Africans. It's your member on the it floor. It is my member. Ubi, Ubi, Gakulu, Kamga, Napa, Umanga, be member, Ikuluma, Kutua, Ikuluma, and Chupego, Abanda, Mia, Makutua. I have my Oshala Nabo, Kukulu, and Gana, what does Abanda Mia make you provide? And what we call the Leon, the Leon, the Leon. Honorable members, please let's allow members <coughs> to proceed. Uh, Second, some long. Yes, I simple no, no, must yet. Tell a cock banak and lend the end a simple no, no, must say the caculament. No must pala a pie. Ukuba attach a mania telukusum, some blue la den match. Ukunisaki say Ukuba abandoned a babayabuela, a macaeli cayeni lamo. Eh, some lomo, second, some lomo, one moms, the obegileo. La corner lay as an andabanag. Yenzi wa pofu, ile par ila pa parliament. Ah, baba sala beta ki wenga lo longi crash. Ensa anjos pa. Ni sala ni tagi we ni na ani na ngondo. On a point of order, chair. On a point of order, chair. There's a member behind you. There. There's a member behind you, honourable member. Chairperson. Uh, Deputy Speaker, this member says we are drunk. I'm going to push you to a lane. I'm going to paralyze, push you to a lane. And notice that you're going to go to a deputy speaker. It's an insult. Point of order, Chair. Point of order, Chair. Yes, Honorable. Point of order, Chair. Chairperson. I'm listening. Members of this house were elected by people, particularly our poor people. I raised a point that these same people are saying when our member is on the point, on of, point of order, a very sensitive matter, she must go and stay with those orphans who are without shelter over their head. Deputy Speaker. What kind of an utterance is that coming from ANC people? Okay. Yeah. We are not owing ANC any fucking tempting man. Deputy Speaker. Yes, Honorable Member. Deputy Speaker. Uh, I challenge you as a presiding officer to bring a breathalyzer now and test who's drunk in this corner, and go there and test a, a, a again or as well. I challenge you now to bring that breathalyzer. We are willing and ready to be tested. We can't be called drunkards as members of parliament because I want to take my drugs. It can't happen that Honorable, way. Honorable members, all of the members who have raised and spoken the way they have used, including the language they have used. Honorable members, we have spoken about this matter in the House. It's beyond me now. I think it, it requires a different response to it altogether. This is uh, the comments that members do whilst others are speaking, and the comments that comes from those who respond to that is uh, something else altogether. I do wish that we do not go into that direction because I would like us, I would, I would, I'm going to refer firstly this thing to the Chief Whips Forum themselves and I would like us to talk to the speaker about how we respond to all of these issues that have been raised in the manner in which they have been raised. I'm coming back here now as I promised earlier on on other rules. Deputy rules. Speaker, before yes. you do that, if yes. I may. I'm sorry, Deputy Speaker, and yes. we can have a discussion about it on the Chief Whips Forum, but there's certain words that are just never uttered in this house. Now, the Honorable Mishlonga has uttered that word. And if you allow it to now go, without asking him to withdraw it, it becomes part of the precedent that that's an acceptable term in the House. Now, I'm happy for you to study the hand side, et cetera, but we all heard that the, what that word was. It's not acceptable for Parliament. And I would ask that he, he is asked to withdraw that word. Honourable, honourable members, uh, Oza Babumchong, Yakbona of Nuguza, Zella Wenango Quark. Deputy Speaker, yeah. 
with all due respect, yes. in law, South African jurisprudence guarantees all of us equality we, and freedom of speech. Yes. We cannot allow, we cannot allow arrogance to dominate our own intellectual thinking in this house as if we are owing anybody anything from the desk of the ANC. Various what? members have requested you through your position to call for a withdrawal of un so-called unparliamentary language here. Yeah. You said yourself, you are going to the hindsight. I will be called to order twice today. None of these people who are behaving recklessly. I spend my time in the trenches fighting for freedom of this country. I don't owe anyone any single thing. EFF here is not owing anyone anything. Now that you are going to be insulted here, and ANC use its cheap, lousy majority, Menshevik style, to dominate us, who they think they are. Honorable member, I thought you were bringing a solution. Uh, you volunteered to come to speak. I thought you were bringing a solution. Honorable, mem Honorable Chief Whip. Deputy Speaker, I just yes. want to point to the precedent that's been created in this house. No, there's no precedent. No, no, there is a precedent. No, there, there is uh, a precedent. Why is I, have a, I have a member who was suspended for a week Honourable for member, using language in the there house. There is no precedent being said. Can you take your seat? I'm if saying, you are not raising will you please new? listen to me, Deputy Speaker? I said, we have precedent in this house. One of my members was found guilty of using that word in the house and was suspended for a week. All I'm asking you to do is be consistent with the rulings of this house and get the member to withdraw it and refer it, Honor and refer it to the Rules Committee. Honorable member, please take your seat. I told you what I'm going to do uh, on the spot here very soon. Yes. Honorable member, what are you raising on?